Good morning, good afternoon and good evening everyone. So today I got uh, Xiaomi Redmi Note 11 and uh, today I will update my mobile phone from MIUI 14 to Hyper Operating System. Let me tell you that this is the official update release for the Redmi Note 11 of the Hyper Operating System. The Android version will be remain same. Android version will not get updated because the Redmi Note 11 will stick with the Android version 13, right? And this update update is for the redmi note 11 global variant in case if you are doing doing it on any other region variant then you have to do it by yourself risk will be yours right my mobile phone is updated to miui 14.0.5 so i have downloaded full recovery rom file of miui 14.0.5 because i'm doing a renaming method which doesn't requires and a lock bootloader right do not downgrade right by this method do not downgrade by this method mobile phone will totally get brick so currently miui 14.0.5 is installed on my mobile phone and this must be the last miui 14 version for the redmi note 11 global variant and there will be no more miui version for coming for the redmi note 11 now the hyper operating system will lead redmi note 11 so i have downloaded the full recovery recovery rom file of the miui 14.0.5 because currently installed on my mobile phone and i have downloaded the hyper operating system updated file also on my mobile phone let me show that the upper one is the operating system of hyper hyper operating system and the second one is the miui 14.0.5 that already installed on my mobile phone both are full recovery rom file see the, the file size upper one is 3.89 gb and the miui 14.0.5 is around 3.7 gb so copy both files if both files are safe in the download folder the both file must be on the main partition copy both files from the downloaded folder then you tap internal storage and paste both file to the main partition the root partition on the internal storage okay after copying both files we have to rename the file so the miui 14.0.5 is currently installed on my mobile phone so i will uh, rename the the miui 14.0.5 rom file because it is currently installed on my mobile phone i will keep tapping on it then i will tap more and then i will tap rename and i will just give name like tap, uh, tapping a that's all a dot z i p tab okay now the rom file got converted from the big file name to short only a dot z i p but i didn't change anything right now with the hyper operating system link already up, uh, provided in my video description now about the data so for the safe side i would suggest to save all the data xiaomi can do anything if you think that the data will not get lost i cannot suggest that and i cannot even see that although the renaming method will not delete the data but for the safe side save the data check the mobile phone uh, battery should be charged to maximum connect internet on the mobile phone right and then go to settings and then uh, always on display and uh, make the sleep time to maximum 10 minutes go back then go to apps manage apps tap three dots show all apps search for updater select the updater file the application then tap clear data clear all data okay okay run go back to settings then scroll down go to additional settings change the region current whatever version oh sorry whatever region you have make it or select united states like currently i have selected the united state as a current system region then go back and go to about phone then we'll tap the miui 14 in case if you are not having any getting any ota update then tap the 14 number for seven times one two three four five six seven additional update features are on then tap three dots tap choose update package where it will go to the file manager tap here and select the redmi note 11 then tap to change the view right scroll down so now what we have to do 
I will select the A file, A.zip file first. Then I will immediately come back to the file manager and I will rename both file. Now check wh what I am doing. If you follow the this thing correctly and do it immediately quickly the thing will st start updating now starting the procedure but before starting just tap recent and uh, clear this window must keep the file manager clear all other rest windows and just tap the file manager to recall it right then tap recent again and recall the updater window back now starting the procedure i will tap to select the a.zip first then tap recent will go through file manager tapping it the rename uh, a.zip more rename and i will tap b okay and i will rename the hyper os more rename and will tap a okay the file name got changed now will tap recent it will go back to downloaded folder and the procedure will start okay your device will update to the system version 14.0.5 yes tap update so the updating procedure started okay it starts now the updating procedure will take time so we have to wait now so finally updating procedure got completed tap reboot now Well, first boot completed. So wait, let finishing the system update. Okay, done. And you can see that wallpaper got changed and the mobile phone got changed from MIUI to hyper operating system, even without losing a single data and everything same in case if you are having applications all will be remain same but that is not 100 percent guarantee that it will be remain here not as i mentioned before that xiaomi can do anything well in my case all the data remains there and my mobile phone got updated from the miui 14 to the hyper operating system current currently official stock release version 1.0.3 and you can see that the Android version is remain 13. So this is how to update the mobile phone from MIUI to hyper operating system in case if your phone still not getting OTA update on your mobile phone even without unlocking bootloader you can update the mobile phone and without losing a signal data but remember do not downgrade right by this method do not downgrade by this method mobile phone will totally get break so thanks a lot for watching a video like the video keep sharing it to others and subscribe my channel thank you see you later goodbye